What's up guys, we're back with another epic first edition opening. We're opening Pharaonic Guardian Blisters. We have not one, but five. Pharaonic Guardian first edition blisters. This is gonna be pretty awesome. We're gonna open those up and we're also gonna do something else pretty cool. We have an opened worldwide edition Stairway to the Destin Duel video game. And we're gonna open up the promos on this video. So it's gonna be really cool. We're gonna do that and we got a giveaway. So the giveaway will be giving away some Pharaonic Guardian cards. We do have a first edition Gravekeeper's Chief. We have Guardian Sphinx and Sasuke Samurai. All you gotta do, like the video, be subscribed, and let me know your favorite card from this opening. It can be from the video game or from Pharaonic Guardian. Let's get into it. So before we do the opening, let's go ahead and get these cards out of the promo. So this was sold to me. A guy actually opened it up and then sold it. Not really sure why he did that, but um, I was like, sure, I'll take it. I'll take the promos, it's pretty cool. So I believe that this is actually not the English version. So I think they might be different promos. It's not like the uh, the regular SDD. So let's close that up. There is the uh, the box for the Stairway to Destin Duel. Yeah, so inside you get these. You get the DDS, the second DDS edition cards, which is pretty weird. It's pretty weird. So we're going to check it out. I think it's cool to uh, have some sort of unique promos. It's kind of like the, S or the uh, TFK Sinister Serpent. It's a very rare card because it's a different version. Okay, let's go ahead and open this. It's not that easy to open. You know, maybe we should cut it open. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna take the scissors to it. Okay, let's be really careful, feel the cards. All right, let's do it at the very top right here. All right, yeah, that's that's a lot easier. I like that better. Except I only think, yeah, okay, that's perfect. Okay, here we go. So we'll cut that open. We have, ooh, check that out. C-R-U. S-D-D-E, so you can see that it has the Euro sign. So let's go ahead and sleeve these up. This card looks pretty nice. We're gonna send it into grade, even though it does cost us $20 now. We'll send this in eventually. The centering is a little bit off. Either way, it'd still be cool to get like even a PSA 9. Or maybe, eh, maybe I'll keep it in the binder if it gets a nine. We'll check it out. We'll see how the centering is on these other ones. Hey, look, this is one had promos, but it wasn't sealed. So uh, maybe one day we'll open a sealed game with promos. Okay, is there a little ding up there? Little ding on this one. So this these, this one looks like a binder copy for sure. So cool. S-D-D-E. So you don't see that very much. Then we have this Salamandra E. That one looks pretty good. Centering is pretty good on that one. Yes, that's nice. All right. So pretty cool set. So you guys, uh, oh, cool. Check this out. All right. So I wonder what this is for because it's not like... It's European, but it's not English, so it's a different a different part of Europe than, like, England and stuff. I don't know. Don't know my languages that well, but there we go. Check that out. Pretty cool set. Pretty awesome. Maybe great, some of them. All right, next we will be opening these blisters. This is going to hurt some of you guys. They did get a little beat up in the shipping, though, because they the post office, like, didn't deliver these. When, it was, like, six days later I finally got them, so I think they kind of beat up the package, but, oh, well, we're going to open them anyway. Let's go ahead and destroy these beautiful blisters. Oh, it always hurts to do this so much. Because you gotta really, you gotta annihilate them. Like with the booster pack, you can open them nice and clean. With the blister pack, you gotta pretty much destroy it. All right, first edition. What can we pull from first edition for on a guardian, you ask? We can pull, out because you think these are retail. The secret rare is Lava Golem. You can also pull the Help Armor, which is the cover card. And there's, it's not too many crazy foils. There are some cool stuff like the Help Armor. The, um, what's his name? The... The 1400 guy with the little sword, and he's got the little eye patch. Well, I don't know. We're going to pull him and find out. But uh, there's also some really good commons like um, Terraforming. There's Book of Moon Rare. I think. Is Necro Valley coming here? I can't remember. But here we go. Let's go ahead and open this up. Let's just see what we get. If we can get a foil out of one of these, it'd be pretty cool. All right. First edition PG. Let's check out the side because a lot of times these were cut like super weird. It looks like these were too. Pharaonic Guardian had the weirdest print quality. Maybe some of the worst. We have D-Tribe. We've got a bird face. Right Sprite. Metamor- Okay, that's a huge card. That's like 14 bucks near mint. So it's not as much as the Rescue Cat, but that's a really good one. I think it's short printed as well, so that's really big. Moisture Creature as a rare. I remember this one. I had this one back in the day. Does it have nine stars though? I think it has nine. Yes, that's really weird. Curse of Aging, Yomi Ship, Gravekeeper's Vassal. So we did get a Metamorphosis, which is really big. Because of GOAT format, very expensive, even as a common, so that's really cool. All right, next blister, we have four more of these. If you guys enjoy this old school, you know, couple packs 
uh, opening. Maybe we'll do some more stuff like this where I just get a few packs and we just take it slow because it is tough to find these at not a very high cost now. So, uh, you know, it's pretty tough. By the way, I'm sure you guys have seen... Actually, I'll cut this out if uh, you guys don't know yet, but we're opening that Cybernetic Revolution First Edition Hobby Box. It's going to be insane. Make sure you guys are there for that. It's going to be pretty awesome. But let's get into this pack. Here we go. Veronica Guardian. First edition, the seventh set in Yu-Gi-Oh! history. So, uh, pretty old. Here we go. Oh, yeah, you can tell these are not even at all. These cards are so uneven, it's not even funny. Like, you can see the cards coming out of the bottom. They're I'm, I'm completely pushing them together. Yeah, that's just so weird. Veronica Guardian is the only set I know of that does that. D-Tribe. It's like, they're, they're different sizes, literally. Birdface. We got a Ride of Spirit. Oh, Cobra Jar. Oh, we ruined the suspense. Wandering Mummy. That's a cool card, though. I did, the artwork on the, in this set is really cool. Raigeki Break. I mean, that's such a strong card for uh, stuff like the Progression Series and all that stuff. So it's a pretty good card. I mean, this is just so weird how different the sizes are. I think it's the rare that's huge. You guys see how big the rare is? Look at that. The rare is, like, so much longer. What in the world happened in Veronic Guardian? I don't know what happened, but they were they were on something when they were printing these. It's crazy. Next pack, we have the third of five. So far, no foils. We have pulled some. Wow, that came off really easily. Perfect. Which could or could not be a bad thing. You'd be like, well, it's resealed, but I think it's not. I think we're good here. All right. The other ones opened pretty di were pretty difficult to open, so. All right. These, uh, I think these, these, um... Seals are a little messed up like that. That usually kind of looks like they've been like in a weird climate. They've been kind of like hot. It got too hot or too cold. We've got a Gravekeeper's Guard. It looks like too hot from that. Hieroglyph Lithograph. We've got a Gravekeeper's Cannon Holder. Cool. Pyramid Turtle. Nice zombie card. Timidy. 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 <laughs> and Moose Yoke. Okay. All right. Okay. We're 0 for 3. That's fine. Nothing big deal. Not, not, not worried about it at all. All right, can we pull something big? Come on. Ferrani Guardian. We haven't opened Ferrani Guardian in a while. We did open a first edition 24-pack booster box of this at one point. And it was a... I can't try to remember. It was a decent pack. I think we pulled Nightmare Wheel. And I got a PSA 10 on the other on the other Ultra. What was it? It was a kind of a boring Ultra, though. I can't remember what it was. All right, next pack. Pack four. Servant of Catabolism. Okay, the Servant Strategy. The Gravekeeper's Guard. Gotta love that card. Hieroglyph Lithograph. Okay, here we go. Come on. Give us the luck. Reckless Greed. All right, we're being a little greedy. Maybe we're being a little greedy. Gravekeeper's Assailant. It's actually a pretty good card. Remember I was building my uh, GOAT Gravekeeper's deck and I needed some of those and I went to my Front and Guardian first edition cards and I found a couple of them. Okay, from when we opened the box. Final pack of the opening. We are 0 for 4. Come on. Let's not go over five, please. Here we go. Here we go. Did we get unlucky? Or can we get the luck here? So sad to destroy blisters like this. I know some of you guys are cringing. But we just need a foil. We just need a foil here. Final pack. Give us the luck. Here we go. Bottomless shifting sand. A man with a widget. Cabazals. Hit the like button for luck, guys. Here we go. Card shuffle. Whew. We need the luck. We need something. Just give us a foil. Oh, a barrel behind the door. Okay, we will take it. It's a super rare. Very warped. Yeah, that's why I guess... I'm guessing these are stored in a weird spot. But we will take it. We got a foil. Not the best one. But we did get one. So pretty nice. We got a trap dust shoot. That's another great common. Another great common from the set. So we pulled metamorphosis. Pulled trap dust shoot. Which actually are like usually like really hard to pull, maybe like one per box or something. And then we pull a barrel behind the door. So that turned out to be okay. Not the best, but okay. Alright, from this opening today, we got the cards I just mentioned. We got the super rare, we got the two nice commons. Then we got the three promos. So those are pretty cool. We're probably gonna check those out. Maybe send in a couple of them to grade. Hope you guys enjoyed this shorter yet first edition old school legacy opening. It was pretty fun. I enjoyed it. Hopefully we can do more cool stuff like this in the future. And that's it for this video. I'll see you guys later. Peace. Oh! Yes. Yes.
<laughs> Elemental hero, dark bright. Boom! Oh, <laughs> <God>. <laughs> 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 